Welcome, welcome, welcome to another wonderful episode of Rise Talks. How are you guys doing? Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. I'm Moses Adesimololu, and I'm the co-founder of Rise Business Solutions. And basically, what do we do? We help tax entrepreneurs, just like yourself that's watching, to build, scale, or sell their profitable tax business. So guys, I'm here today coming to you to just talk about what do you do when you get a client who gets paid, but then you don't get paid. What am I saying here? Now, some of you that are watching are tax entrepreneurs, and some of you, when you file taxes for individual, you get your money after they get paid, right? Now, there is a number that you will call to identify if they have a debt. This number is a number, I will leave it in the um, comments, but it's a number that you call, and this number is the number given by the IRS to identify if your taxpayer owes a debt. Now, they need to write um, a response saying that they are giving you the authorization for you to look up their social security. All right. Now, supposedly, you did not get to do that. And now this client gets paid. This client gets paid. As this client gets paid, it goes towards a debt. And now you don't get your money. You're like, man, how do I get my money? Sometimes you could get very busy to the point where you might not, because this has even happened to me. You know, upon all these years that I've been filing taxes, there are a few clients who, you know, I might not have checked to see if they owe, and they actually owe. For example, I had a client who I would not even expect to have owed any money. This client came into my office, did her taxes, knew she owed money, but didn't even disclose that information to me. Filed her taxes, you know, I did what I did for her, matched all her uh, um, taxes and everything, matched her expenses and all of that, and now she gets a big refund, and now that refund is going to her debt. She gets paid, and I'm like, man, how am I going to get my fees? So this is the main. This is the main reason why I'm doing this. What do you do when this client like this gets paid and you can't get your fees? First, what do you do? Give her a call. Hey, uh, you know, and I never got my um, fees. You know, you got paid. Now, sometimes they play dumb and act like they don't know what you're saying, but you say, okay, well, you got paid and whoever you owe took it. And they say, oh, yeah, yeah, that's right, I remember. <laughs> exactly, right? So now you say, I need to get my fees. If it's a responsible person, it's okay, well, how much is your fees? Or I know how much your fees is. Can I come into the office and pay you? Or can I? you send me an invoice? So that's how you do it. You either send them an invoice or they come and pay you for you to get your fees. Now, if they're not trying to do that, which, you know, some of these people don't want to do that, they expect you to work for free. So now you have to tell them that, look, you need to pay me because I've offered my services to you. Now, there are people who will come up with different scenarios, they might call you unprofessional, they might say, oh no, I don't think I need to pay you. You know, they might come up with different things. Don't ever stress yourself about those people. Just know that you will still remain blessed. You will still get your clients, okay? So if they end up not wanting to pay you, it's not nothing for you to stress up about and feel like, oh man, you know, they don't want to pay me. Sometimes, this particular client will come back to you next year. So when they come to you next year, you know how to attack it and get your fees. 
I just want to let you guys know that, you know, don't stress out of when you get a client who does not pay you. When you get a client who has gotten paid, but then you don't get paid for your services. There's another thing that you can write off. This particular thing you can write off as bad debt expenses on your taxes, and you can write these things off. This is what the big companies are doing. It's called bad debt. Any kind of debt from a customer that doesn't get paid, you get write it off on your taxes, and you're good. So it's a win-win situation for you. Don't stress yourself when you get a client who does not pay you, okay? Just wanna let you guys know that quick information. Believe in yourself and believe in the mind that you have within yourself. You have the skill as a tax entrepreneur. You could go out there and go get it. So keep on going out there and going to get it. And if you would like to join our mastermind, we having the mastermind coming on very, very soon. So if you would like to join, just give us a call, 1-888-679-6771, or the link is below to where you could click on, click on the link and move on forward. You know, guys, believe in yourself and know that the time is now to act. All right, y'all. Have a good day and remain blessed. Peace out.